Yo, what's happening guys? This is Flo, and I'm here with Sly. And today we're going to talk about what Magic Johnson said that he's pulling for the Golden State Warriors to beat the Boston Celtics in the NBA Finals that he doesn't want to see the Celtics break that championship tie and get that one up on us. So Sly, what do you think about this? Yeah, I agree, man. I really do agree. Um, it seems like we're pulling for the Warriors crazy, believe it or not. You know, our little brother, the team that we used to always beat like a stepchild all through the... <laughs> every decade pretty much 60s 70s 80s 90s whatever it was um always beat the crap out of them and now they've grown up and they're playing and they lost the first game so it's going to be interesting to see um i'll still be i guess pulling for the warriors even though i'm not a big fan but just because i don't want the war the celtics to get that 18 ring, you know right now we finally caught up it took years and years and years to finally catch them and now all of a sudden what they're going to pass us up again can't let that happen man the warriors got to do something because I do not want them to be number one in the championships again. It just doesn't make sense, man. The Lakers are the team that everybody, you know, they're the global brand. They're the team that the most popular team in, in America. So, and all across the nation. So, we got to hope the Lakers, you know, the Warriors pull it off. So, we'll be stuck at 17. And next year, LeBron regroup AD, get that 18th ring, be on top. What do you think? Yeah, man, obviously that quest for 18, first team to get there, man, they're going to have the bragging rights. So we need the Warriors to step up, man. Obviously, Celtics are only three games away now from uh, hosting that trophy. But I don't know, the Warriors, they do have that heart of the champion. They've proven they could uh, win a title. This is actually the first time I think they're down from the game one. Usually they do win that. So that has me a little worried. But I hope they step up, man, take out the Celtics. Obviously, I freaking hate rooting for the Warriors, but I think the Celtics are the bigger evil. Obviously, they're the biggest evil if you're a Los Angeles Lakers fan, so um, I don't want to hear that. Unfortunately, we have some family members who are Celtics fans also, and I don't want to hear those freaking guys, man. I'll have mm -hmm. to hear that for a whole year. You know, when us Lakers fans, we win. We celebrate for that week. Yeah, it's all good, but these guys, man, they, they haven't really got a win since the 60s, so every time they win, man, we have to hear for it for the whole freaking year, so I don't want to hear that, man. Warriors better step it up and freaking win this chip. Yeah, man. Actually, both my brothers are Celtics fans. So, I mean, it's it's really interesting, you know. Them, you know, they really, typical Celtics fan, don't t watch the season. They say they're going to stop watching it. And then they start watching it again when they're good again. So, it's BS, man. So, but then again, like, we have a lot of Warriors family as well, too. And they're bandwagon fans, too. So, it goes both ways, you know. Both these fan bases, they're weak. But... You know, hey, we're going to watch it. We're going to enjoy the rest of the series. Hopefully the Warriors pull it off, you know, and a little brother could uh, help us out here. So we're going to see, man. It should be interesting. Yeah, man. I'd rather have the Warriors hit that seventh ring than the Celtics get that 18th ring. Mm -hmm. But you guys let us know in the comments what you guys think about what Magic Johnson said. Like, comment, subscribe. Hit that notification bell. See you all next time. Peace. Peace.